Welcome or welcome back to A Budget Full of Grace. My name is Karen and today we are going to be stuffing the second half of my husband's paycheck. I've been dividing his paychecks in half to make our money last longer. So if this is something that you would be interested in, please go ahead and keep on watching. Today we are going to be stuffing $510 plus any rollover that we have. So let's count that out. 100, 200, 300, 350, 400, 450, 470, 490, 500, 510. I'm actually going to go ahead and push that back because I do know that we have rollover, so I wanna make room for that. All right. Eating out has nothing. Gas has one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight dollars in rollover. Groceries, nothing. Karen, that's mine. We'll go ahead and count that. 100, 120, 130, 131. And this just rolls over. The same for my husband. Oh, we don't have to count us. Ellie Grace, it's our daughter. She has 100, 100, just kidding. $1, $2. That gets rolled over into her future envelope. And then we have miscellaneous, which has 10, 15, 20, 21, 22, 23. And how are you guys doing today? Hope that you guys are doing well. You'll notice I have a different flower situation going on today. It's so pretty. So I just wanted to um, display it for as long as the flowers decide to live. Real quick, receipts. Receipts galore. I do need to scan these into my Fetch Rewards. Fetch is an app where you can scan in your receipts and those receipts turn into points and then those points turn into rewards that you're able to redeem for gift cards. This is my referral link right here on the screen and then I'll go ahead and put it in the description. I do get points if you do decide to use my referral code. So as soon as I'm done, I'll go ahead and scan these in. All right, let's go ahead and stuff variable. Eating out is going to be getting $50. And I don't think I said it, but rollover was $33. Just so we're aware, gas is going to be getting $100. Groceries is going to be getting $200. My husband and I were each going to be getting $50. So I now have 100, 150, 170, 180, 181. Doesn't matter how much money he has. If it's not my money, I don't care. Ellie is going to be getting $10. Miscellaneous is going to be getting $40, and that is supposed to cover our day dates. Now that my daughter is in an MDO program, we basically don't have her at home during the day. My husband does work from home on Monday, so that is our goal. Moving on to short term, not every envelope is going to be getting stuffed today. That's pretty much how paycheck stuffings go. Beauty is going to be getting $10 today. Beauty now has 100, 120, 140, 150, 160, 165, and 170. Birthdays is going to be getting $6. Birthdays now has 100, 120, 130, 135, 136, 137, 138, 139, 140. And this is perfect because my mom's birthday is coming up. I am in charge of the cake and of course her gift. So that's about $120. We're gonna go back all the way to necessities. 
this is in alphabetical order and I don't know my alphabet. Okay, necessities is going to be getting $4. So one, two, three, and four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. We did stock up on laundry detergent and other household needs. So I'm just trying to bulk this back up. And we are pretty much done in short term. Lastly, we have long term. Of course, Ellie is getting her $10. And then she has $2 from her rollover. So she now has 1,000, 2,000, 2,100, 2,110, 2,120, 2,130, 2,131, 2,132. This is money that we have set aside for her future. This is money that gets invested every single week. Baby is going to be getting $2. No, I'm not pregnant. We are just letting God take care of that. So, <laughs> well, obviously us too. Anyways, uh, 100, 200, 210, 211, 212. And I'm pretty sure the last envelope getting stuffed is our 100 envelope challenge. I did fill out the $9 envelope slot because I knew how much rollover we were gonna have so one two three and four and I already put the five ten fifteen twenty twenty one twenty two twenty three twenty four twenty five twenty six twenty seven and twenty eight twenty eight dollars I know it was a short one, but I still appreciate you dropping by and watching my video. Uh, please go ahead and give me a thumbs up. Drop a comment down below. Let me know what you and your family are doing this weekend. And of course, subscribe, no pressure. It does obviously help out my channel if you are here. Subscribe, viewing, commenting. I hope you all have a great weekend and I will see you guys in my next one.